A Minot school continued its tradition of honoring our veterans with a special car parade today. Kiona Rivera headed to Edison Elementary for reaction. Friday's car parade is something these Edison Elementary students have been looking forward to in their school day. For Air Force veteran Paul Engeldinger, it's his fourth year taking part. He calls it a touch of reality. The interaction with the kids, especially some of them salute you back and so on. So that's just, it's a good thing. Uh, I'm glad to see the patriotism uh, is alive and well here. The veterans drive by the perimeter of the school where students and staff wave and cheer them on. School principal Jeremy Melhoff says the parade is one way to get students to understand that it takes a community to help one another. It's just awesome, you know, especially with mine, you know, with the Air Force Base here and, and having so many families connected to the military. I think it's just awesome for our kids to have a chance to give thanks. Engeldinger was stationed in Minot three times during his 24 years in the Air Force, serving in the 5th Bomb Wing and 23rd Bomb Squadron. Stand up for your principles, uh, always respectful but be strong. Both men say they plan to make the most out of Veterans Day this year. I'm going to probably spend some time with my dad um, and, and my family and, and just enjoy the day. I will be going to the traditional 11-11-11, um, 11th hour, 11th month, uh, uh, the 11th day. Honoring patriotism and one's willingness to serve. In Minot, I'm Kiona Rivera reporting for your news leader. This is the fifth year that Edison held a car parade. The parade was followed by a music program from the Edison students.